Bonjour, comment allez-vous? Hello, how are you? Welcome back to my YouTube channel, Learn French with Anubhav. If you have already subscribed to my channel, press the bell icon to get the latest updates. In today's class, we are continuing with this topic, form verbal a form nominal. Hence, this is the part 2 of this topic, right? Part 1 video, you will get the link in the description box. You can watch it if you haven't. Okay, so in the previous video, I discussed the reason behind doing this topic. The reason being is that because such sort of questions you can get in the exams, right? It can come as a separate question in the grammar section or it can come as a part of the comprehension passage question, right? Two way dollar text. So, for such sort of questions, you need to be aware of this topic in both sense, okay? If you are given the verb form, then you should be able to identify the noun form, and if you are given the noun form, then you should be able to identify the verb form, okay? Hence, we are doing this. And in fact, we are continuing this topic because there are a lot of verbs to be discussed, right? So in the first video, we discussed 12. In the part 2 also, we are going to discuss 12. And if you want the part 3, you can let me know in the comment section. I can make a video uh, on it again. The third part, right, where we will discuss the another set of 12 verbs and their noun forms, right? So, without wasting any other further minute, we are starting with today's discussion with the verb valuar valuar to be worth to be worth or value right to value so the noun form will be simply value valor okay valor masculine singular and as i said in my previous video i will be writing the articles to indicate which one is masculine singular which one is feminine singular Okay, la valeur means value. Number two, we have netra. To be born. Right. So the long form of to be born will be what? Birth, right? La naissance. Opposite of birth is what? Opposite of netra? Murir. To die. Its noun form? Sorry, not la, it's la. Yes, la more. Death. Fourth one, we have don't say. Dance means to dance. And this noun form, la dance. D A N S E, dance. Fifth one, we have asiore. Asiore, uh, the spelling and the pronunciation is very much giving a hint that it means to assure. Right, assure, to assure, oh, wait, to assure, right, assure, so assure, the noun form, l'assurance, okay, L apostrophe because it's beginning with a wobble. Sixth one we have fete. Fete means to celebrate. So the noun form of celebrate will be what? Celebration. Right. Celebration, say a festival or a party. Right. So in French we have the word fete. So la. Fête. Right, I am not writing the meaning here because it's the same thing. Uh, don'ts is also very much evident. Don'ts, don'ts. In English, there is C. In French, there is S. Okay, la fête means festival. You can take a few seconds. Till then, I am rubbing the top three. Okay, 
to discuss the next three, right? We have discussed the first six of this video. Now we are left with last six of this video, okay? Number seven. Seventh, we have neige. Neige means to snow. And this noun form is very easy to snow. Noun form will be what? Snow, right? La neige. N e i g e. La neige. Eighth one, we have saltir. Saltir means to go out. What could be the noun form? Like maybe from where we can go out, right? And that's what? Exit, right? So it is la salty. This means exit, this means no. S O R T I E, okay. Ninth one. We have voir. Voir means to see. Right. And it's a uh, noun form. View. Okay. So, voir means to see. Noun form. La. View. V. U. E. Three more. So, now I need to raise these three. Tenth one, we have voyage. To travel. Um, the noun form of to travel will be what? Trip, right? La voyage. Eleventh, prepare. To prepare. I have told the noun form of prepare numerous times in my vlogs. Right, prepare is what? The noun form? Preparation. Preparation. Right. So, la preparation. P R E with accent U P A R A T I O N. And lastly, number 12, the last one for today's video. Arete means to stop. And its noun form is simply Lare. It begins with a vowel, hence L apostrophe. And it is masculine singular. For example, if you want to say bus stop, right, then what will we say? Are there tubus? Right, bus stop. So in that way, we are using this word, like stop, right. Hmm, with this, we have discussed another 12 uh, verb forms and their corresponding noun forms, right. If you want a part 3, do let me know in the comments. And we can put a halt here for today's video. So yeah, say to Pujudui, that's all for today. If you like this video, please give the thumbs up and subscribe to my YouTube channel, Learn French with Anupav. And if you have any doubt or suggestion, you may write that in the comment section below. You may also like my Facebook page by the same name, Learn French with Anupav. See you in my next video. Thanks for watching. Au revoir, n'oubliez pas que la langue française est l'amour.